We are here as uh, we embark upon another day uh, tomorrow of motions hearings, and I wanted to uh, be here, stand here with uh, Interim Commissioner Davis to assure uh, the Baltimore community uh, on on mass, you know, the, the the neighborhoods, the business community, the institutions uh, of our city that we are prepared uh, for whatever the outcome of the motions hearing is tomorrow. And um, we have shown uh, through the last uh, motions hearing uh, day that we are prepared. We continue to work to strengthen the lines of communication and to uh, ensure that we are uh, prepared moving forward as these six trials um, move through the legal process. Uh, we, we are keeping our ear to the ground to make sure that we're aware of any uh, potential protests. And uh, I want to thank the, the members of the community and the, and the men and women of the police department, all who I think handled themselves with uh, the, the police department in particular with professionalism and uh, the, the vast majority, again, of the, the protesters who handled themselves with uh, due respect in expressing their uh, First Amendment uh, right in protest uh, or demonstration during the last motion hearings. And we hope that that tradition will continue as we move forward with that. Okay. Uh, leave has been canceled tomorrow so uh, without giving out particular numbers and strategies we we have the appropriate amount of BPD police officers and the appropriate amount of partners from other jurisdictions here in the city to help us and it's uh, it's our goal that you never even have to see those folks but um, the community would uh, would not expect us not to be prepared so we do have those assets available